October 22nd, 2020, Daily Math Review. Alright, so select a box to match each expression on the left, so over here, to its equivalent or equal expression. Alright, so remember our smiley faces? What I did, I pulled each of these three expressions and pulled them out and put them over here. Let's start with 10 times that quantity of 3 plus 2 and quantity. So what do we do with that 10? Oh yeah, we're going to circle it. So let's circle the number in front of the parentheses. Maybe. Maybe. There we go. So we're going to circle that number in front of the parentheses. Then what are we going to do? We're going to distribute it. So we're going to multiply it through. So 10 times 3. And then we have 10 um, times 2. So remember, those arrows are going to go to each of the parts inside, each of those terms inside the parentheses. Now, there's going to be a plus in the middle. In this case, all of them are an addition symbol, and all of the other expressions are addition as well, so we won't need to worry about that. We can just always double check. So 10 times 3. If I have 10 times 3, I know that that is, um, if I do 10 times 3, plus, keep that plus, and then we have 10 times 2. All right, now, I'm going to make that a little bit bigger for us to make sure we can fit it all. All right, now, after that, we know that, there we go, we know that 10 times 3 is 30. We're going to keep that addition symbol, and then 10 times 2 is 20. So 30 plus 20. Which of these say 30 plus 20? In that order. Ah, A, box A. So I'm going to drag my smiley face over that A. So it's going to be box A. All right, next part. So we have 9 times the quantity of 9 plus 5. Well, we're going to circle that 9. And then we are going to distribute it. So 9 times 9, and then that plus, and then we're going to have 9 times 5. So 9 times 9 is going to be 81. 81, and then we're going to keep that addition. 9 times 5 is 45. Which one of these says 81 plus 45? There it is right over here. So I'm going to put that smiley face in that box letter H. All right, last one. So we have five times the quantity of four plus six. All right, so I'm going to take my circle, circle the number in front of the parentheses, and now we're going to distribute it. We're going to multiply it through. So we'll have that five times four. We'll keep that plus, and then we'll have five times six. Well, I know that five times four is 20. And then I'm going to keep that addition symbol. And then 5 times 6 is going to be 30. So what in that order shows 20 plus 30? Well, right here, 20 plus 30. So letter K. So those are going to be our three options. Great job.